you know, never part of a master plan. And it was one of the things I struggled with while I was at Goldman. And I talked to a lot of, of young people who it was always a part of their master plan. And you, you meet someone who's like, I'm a step behind. I didn't know when I was 14 years old that I wanted to work on Wall Street and I was never prepared. I didn't go to a target school. I didn't, I didn't have the the liberal arts degree or the or the right. undergrad with business degree degree, I'll never make it. So for me, like I said, I, at first I thought I was gonna go to law school and public affairs and sociology was the right mix to ultimately take the LSATs and and go to law school. Um, but when I learned more and more about what lawyers did, decided I had no real desire to be a lawyer, I went to my counsel at IU and, and said, hey, what's the what's the right move for me and uh, she asked what i ultimately wanted to do i said you know i'm not totally sure i I think i want to work in business or finance And at that point i still didn't totally know what that meant right and her guidance was well if you want to switch to the kelly of school business it's going to cost you real time it's going to cost you at least an additional year at school and that just wasn't on the cards for me so what i ultimately did is why it was just uh, money yeah, money. It was all driven by money. You know, yeah. I was I was taking out loans to to, to get through school, mm-hmm. uh, and it just wasn't practical to to take another year's worth of debt out uh, or time. And, and at that point, I think I was ready to work, even though I didn't necessarily know what that meant. Right. So the guidance from the from the counselor, and you know, I look back on it, and it was such a simple thing, but it it really transformed my life in, in a lot of ways. Was to change my focus within the School of Public Environmental Affairs to uh, a public finance focus. 